Yo lo sé, man. Sí. Sí, ya no está a las 5. Estás a las 5, Aran, ya. Chicos, ¿cómo se llama el teacher? Hola. Joel, sí. Se llama Joel. Joel, Joel Luis, castellano. Gracias. Compañero Luis, en la playa está usted. ¿va? Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Luis, mire, que está en la playa, le digo, ahí está la cabaña, tomando agua y coco. Será agua y coco. Agüita y coco. I'm, having, I'm, I'm using a new computer. Y ando todo trabado acá buscando las teclas. Ah, se le movieron, dice. Se me arruinó, <ríe> se me arruinó mi compu. Y estoy usando oh. la de mi sobrinito y ando buscándole <ríe> las teclas. Sí, ya. Tiene que auxiliarse con otra. 
y no, no puede buscar un, un, una USB así con el teclado, poner un teclado aparte. Uh, no tiene. No, o sea, es, es que las teclas las tienen diferentes posiciones. Sí, es que está un, es que teclado español y teclado inglés. Ajá. No, no, no es ese. No. No ese es el problema, o sea, la ubicación en sí de los, no, no en el sistema, sino incluso las flechas navegadoras la, las tiene muy, ah, a, sí, muy sí, abajo, sí. las mías las estaban sí, arriba. Sí, una se acostumbra, ajá, la, sí. la, 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 es cierto. Yes. Caos. Y, no, y justo hoy a la, a, a la una de la tarde me di cuenta que no me encendía mi computadora, así que me ajá. fui a sacarla de mi sobrinito. ¿Le duró bastante? Más o menos. Como cuatro años. Sí. Acaba la pandemia. Y, y justo para eso la compré, porque la, la mía, la otra que me duró como ocho años, todavía está buena. El problema es que no le encuentro batería. Se le gastó la batería, se le terminó la batería y no le encuentro batería. Entonces ahí la tengo, pero con ella para trabajar necesito tenerla enchufada. Ajá, pero con cortes de energía igual, peligroso. Se le, se uh -huh. va. Sí, entonces para la, cuando iniciamos con esto de las clases en línea, pues compré esa otra. Y, sí. y, y como era algo urgente, pues era pollito, es un HP, pero tres años me duró, tres años y medio quizás. Sí. Okay, anyways, welcome, good evening, everyone. Um, welcome. I good hope evening. you had a very good day today. Today is Thursday, right? Friday is free. Plans for the weekend, Saturday or Sunday. Any plans? No plants. No plants, coach. Daddy. Oh, come on. Why not? Coach, yes. eh, eh, sleep is dorm dormir, ¿verdad? Yes. Don't tell me that you are going to sleep. Okay. Eh, my plan is sleep every day. Oh, today is todo el día, ¿verdad? All day. Ah, all day. All day. Okay. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? I'm that's, <laughs> that's very boring. Amo dormir, coach. Me hace feliz. <laughs> oh, come on. Sometimes on weekends, because now um, sometimes Santana is boring, I'm, um, sometimes I go to drink a cup of coffee to Metro Centro, but there in San Salvador, just for a cup of coffee. I like to travel because now Santana sometimes is boring. Traditional, ¿cómo se dice? Traditional? Uh, traditional or uh, Starbucks. No, that's uh, expensive. No, traditional. <clears throat> yes, that's expensive. Okay, let's begin. Ready? This is what we practice. Oh, this is the conversation that we practiced yesterday, right? It uh, it talks about music. Mm -hmm. Just to remember, and probably uh, yesterday some people didn't practice the conversation. Um, who wants to, to practice today? Anyone? Someone? José David. Okay. José David, you are Tom. And Hazel, you are Liz. 
Good, thank you. Okay, Tom, you start, Jose David. Hey, do you like rap, Liz? No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I do. I am a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Doesn't he play the piano? The piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess. I don't know much about rap. So what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. What's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. That's perfect. Very good. Thank you. Kind. Don't forget. Kind. What kind? What kind of music? Mm -hmm. Someone else? More volunteers? Jennifer. Tatiana. Uh, Jennifer, you are Tom. Okay, coach. Do you like rap, Liz? I don't like it very much. Do you? Uh, yeah, I do. I am a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Do, does he play the piano? The piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about rap. So, what uh, kind no of pop music do you like? Get that, uh, I really like pop music. Who is your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't. I don't like pop music very much. Thank you, guys. That was really good. I don't know. There's someone else. <clears throat> Nidia. Okay, Nidia. Another person. Me, teacher. Okay, Carla. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Um, Nidia, you are Tom. Do you like rap, Liz? No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I don't. I'm a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? The piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about the rap. So, what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Who's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you like her? No. I don't, I don't like pop music very much, very much. Very much, yes, good, thank <laughs> you very much. Uh, kind, <laughs> thank you. kind, right? What kind of music do you like? What kind of music do you like? Um... There was a uh, voice, don't remember, voice, voice, her voice. Mm -hmm. Okay, someone else? I mean, we are like Luis Antonio. Okay. Someone else? A lady? <clears throat> Uh, 
Sarina. Thank you, Sarina. Okay, um, Luis, you are Tom. Okay, do you like rap, please? No, I don't like it very much, do you? Yeah, I do. I'm a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? The piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess. I don't know much about rap. So, what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Who's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. Nice. Very good. Thank you, guys. There was another person, I don't remember who. Someone, someone who wants to practice, who wants to read. No more. Okay. Uh, I mean, a lot of people practiced yesterday, right? We are reviewing this conversation and just to, to get another chance for the ones who didn't practice yesterday. Um, let's move on. What we're going to practice today is this. I'm going to start with this. I'm, I'm going to show you another presentation. Let's see. This one. Okay. Uh, we're going to start today with pronouns, object pronouns, but just to remember a little bit of subject pronouns. Which are the subject pronouns? Just to refresh, can you mention the subject pronouns? Does, doesn't. Mm. Do, do. You, I. Okay, those are auxiliaries. Do and does are auxiliaries. Yes, the subject pronouns, I, you, he, we, she, he. it. It, we, they. We, they. Those are subject pronouns, right? Today, and uh, probably you know a little bit about object pronouns. Which are the object pronouns? Any idea? His, her, no. My, your, her. Okay, you, her. Me, me, him, him, perfect. Those is, are the ones. Mm -hmm. Us. Yes. Ah, you remember that. Check this. You work hard. She reads books. They drink coffee. There you have subject, verb, complement. Subject, verb, complement. Subject, verb, complement. You, she, they. Those are subject pronouns. Subject pronouns are words that we use to start a sentence. They are in the position of the sentence, the position of the subject before, this is a key, before the verb. Mm -hmm. We can use them instead of names because we can say Maria, reads books that's the name but if you remember pronouns substitute nouns right we can say maria reads books or she reads books oops what happened here? they drink coffee oops there's something wrong 
Juan and Sofia drink coffee. Juan and Sofia drink coffee. Or we can say they drink coffee. And there you have the subject pronouns. I, you, he, she, it, we, they. Martin likes ice cream. My mom and I play chess. We can say he likes ice cream. We play chess. John called me. Andy likes hair. I emailed them. Now, if you notice, we have subject, verb, object. Now you have me, hair, and them. John called me, me, right? Andy likes hair. I email them. Object pronouns. These are words that we use. He, you see, subject before the verb. Objects go after the verb. They are in the position of object. We can use them instead of names. It means that they also substitute names because you can say Andy likes Erin or Andy likes hair. I emailed them or I emailed Patrick and Stephen or I emailed them. I love Maria. Or I love her. My mother bought my sister and I a gift. Or my mother bought us a gift. My mother bought us a gift. Teacher. Yes. What is bon? Boat is comprar en pasado. Compró. My mother bought us a gift. It means nos compró. My mother bought us. Okay. And there you have the object pronouns. Me, you, him, her, it, us, them. Sandra loves Alfred, or she loves him. My sister and I have bags, or we have them. <clears throat> no comments so far. Is it clear? Okay, totally in the practice. Let's work. It says, Susan lives with her parents. Or we can say, She, she, lives. she, lives, she lives with her grandparents. With her grandparents. That's she okay. lives with her. Mm -hmm. What about number two? Susan lives with her grandparents. Susan lives with With them. They are hers. Them. Oh, them. She lives with her grandparents or Susan lives with them. Because in this case, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> in this case, we cannot use they. Ella vive con ellos. We cannot use they. Okay. Because if you remember, they is a subject pronoun. Y los subject pronouns 
van antes del verbo. Uh, ahí sí sería they, pero cuando habla van después del verbo, tiene que ser el object pronoun. Susan lives with them. Let's see another example. My friends play Fortnite. The second he play. Sorry? He play. Mm, but it says they. my they because it's plural. My friends. They? They. They. Play Fortnite. Mm -hmm. Number four. My friends play Fortnite. So my friends play. For him. Play it. Sing. Play it. Play it. Play it because. It's something, right? Check. Mm. They play Fortnite. My friends play it. They play it very well. Another one, number five. Peter has a surprise for his teacher. He has a surprise for his teacher. That's good. Peter has a surprise for his teacher. Peter has a surprise for him. Him. Him or her, because we don't know. Mm -hmm. Peter has a surprise for her. In case the teacher is a woman, or for him, in case the teacher is a man. My dad loves my brother and I. He. He loves my brother and I. That's correct. In number eight. My dad. Love he, us. Love us. Love us. Love us. Or you can say my dad loves us. Loves us. My dad loves us. Mm -hmm. Says, loves us. Why? Because this is a key when you have two words like this one. You have loves with S and then you have a vowel, sonido de, con, de vocal. Entonces la vocal se une a la consonante anterior. My dad loves us. Loves us. My dad loves us. Okay. More examples. My sister and I help my mother. We, we help, help my, my mother. mother. We. We. In number 10. My sister and I help yeah, her. Help. help? Her. her. Good. Help <laughs> her. In this case, you can also join because no pronunciamos la H. Podemos decir my sister and I help her. Help her. Help her. Mm -hmm. Y por eso es que a veces no entendemos cuando las personas unen las palabras. My sister and I help her. Y entendemos otra cosa, ¿no? My sister and I help her. But it's very common that we join those words. When we have a consonant and then we have a vowel or a vowel sound and we join. Helper loves us. Next, the girl is with the dog. She is with a dog. That's it. In number 12. The girl is with the it. The girl is it with him. With it. With it. With it. With it. Mm -hmm. The girl is with it. That's it. The girl is with it. Cool. That was really nice. Easy, right? 
piece of cake. Yes or no? I have another one. So we can practice more. Check this one. More practice. Subject and object. You have to choose the correct one. Um, tell me the complete sentence using the correct pronoun, subject or object. Subject. Sorry? Hey. Okay, read the complete idea, please. The complete sentence. This is my friend Tom. He is from Britain. Very good. Next. <clears throat> I Kim. met him at the beach Kim. last summer. Kim. I met him at the beach last summer. Perfect. Kim. Mm -hmm. I met him at the beach last summer. Good. One more. She. His mother is a doctor. She works at hospital. In the hospital. Hospital. That hospital, that's correct. Cool. Mm -hmm. She works in that hospital. Next. Her yesterday. Yep. I saw her yesterday. Very good. Next. Next. My parents, parents like watching films. films. I Great. often go to the cinema with them. Perfect. Them. With them. Very good. One more. <laughs> Bob and I usually usually play tennis together. We use our our good at it. Very good. We are good at it. We are good at it. Next. We won the match, so they gave us a trophy. Excellent. They gave us a trophy. They. Dylan Joe are very They play in the basketball team. They play in the basketball team. Great. One more. I'm studying English now because I have an exam tomorrow. Very good. I have an exam tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And the last one. I told I her the truth, but she didn't believe me. She didn't believe in me. Yes. I told her the truth, but she didn't believe me. Any problem? Aunque el teacher en el anterior, uno que llevaba am and I. En este, ajá. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. No cuenta la I de am stood. No. 
um, because in this case you have two sentences. You have two. You have two verbs in English. You need a subject for each verb. In English, cada verbo debe llevar su sujeto, la persona que realiza ese verbo. Um, en la primera, I am studying. El verbo estudiar. Yo estoy estudiando. Luego tenemos because. Este se le llama linking word porque va a unir otra oración. Entonces, esa otra oración debe de llevar sujeto. Because I have. Porque tenemos ese otro verbo have, tener. Y ese verbo necesita su sujeto. I have an exam tomorrow. Ok. What else? No problem. Okay, let's see. Okay, now if you notice in this conversation, there you have some object pronouns. Do you like rap, please? No, I don't like it. Mm -hmm. No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I do. I'm a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about rap. So what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Who's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you, do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. And there you have the object pronouns here. Yes. And what we are going to practice, just no questions and WH questions. Do you remember that? Um, if you notice, este es otro repaso de un nivel previo o un módulo previo. That's yes, no questions and WH questions. Do you like rap? Yes, I do. I like it a lot. No, I don't. No, I don't like it very much. Does he play the piano? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Do they like the Beatles? Yes, they do. They love them. No, they don't like them very much. There you have the, and those are auxiliaries, right? Somebody mentioned the auxiliaries. Do and does, okay? And we practice object pronouns. Then we have the WH questions. What kind of music do you like? I like rock a lot. What does he play? He plays the guitar. Who do they like? They like you too. Now, but before this, let's try to, to practice making questions. Again, let's, I'm going to, I'm going to start and we're going to try to, uh, to ask one another or everybody. You can ask your classmates or you can ask me and I'm going to ask you. Okay, just yes, no questions or WH questions. 
Uh, for example, I'm going to start. Yo comienzo a preguntar. Everybody, okay? We are going to have a, a conversation speaking. Let's see. Um, um, Luis, what kind of sports do you like? Luis Antonio, what kinds of sports do you like? Luis Antonio, what kinds of sports do you like? I like soccer and... Soccer. I like on... soccer, teacher. Only soccer? Uh, I love, I love um, running. Running, okay. When, when do you play soccer? Uh, I play soccer on weekends. On weekends, okay. Who do you play soccer with? Uh, usually I play soccer with my friends and my neighborhood. Your neighbors, with your neighbors. My neighbors. Uh-huh, yeah. your neighbors, okay. Good, thank you very much. Now, volunteers, ¿quién quiere entrevistar a quién? Now you. ¿Alguien quiere entrevistar a alguien? Coach, las preguntas son con W question, ¿verdad? Or yes, no, eh, no do, questions. Do, do. Okay. We are eh, practicing yes, no questions and WH questions. Ok, no problem. Oh, ok, eh, mi pregunta va dirigida a David. <laughs> Ajá, David. David, what is your favorite place? Your favorite place, place. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ajá, Luis. No, David. Ah, oh, David, David, David. Ajá. José David. Exacto. Ajá, José David. What's mm -hmm. your favorite place? Excuse me. Ah, andaba por el what, oh. <laughs> what is the question? What is your favorite place? Oh, my favorite place is soccer. Mm, oh. Your favorite place? place. Uh, what mean place? Um... Lugar, um, ah, okay. ya sea la playa, el volcán. Ah, ah um, I like the mountain. Mountains, cool. Uh, I, I like the hospital. Oh, Why? Great. Because Why they... because it's uh, very cold. Um, it's beautiful. Okay. It's a place, a beautiful place. Okay. Thank you very much, Jennifer. Paulina, who one, who do you want to ask or to interview? Uh, I want to interview to Hazel. Okay, Hazel. Um, this is difficult. To think. Um, I I like your hair very much, and I'm I'm don't know if I'm wrong, but what color is your hair? Because I I thought your hair was blue or green in the puntitas. 
Uh -huh. And my daughter love it. Or I'm not, if I'm wrong to. It's, it's color. Ajá. Con turquesa. Yes. Turkey. Seriously, yo no veo. Okay. Over here. Oh. It's, it's very, very. Oh. ¿Cómo se dice? Sutil. Soft. Soft. And my daughter saw her in one class and, and, and she told me, oh, I want it. <laughs> Great. But she's only 10. No <laughs> permission. No permission. Mm. Not yet, but. Okay. Cool. That's nice. More questions, Paulina? No. No more. Only one. No more. Okay. Good. Thank you very much. Somebody else? More questions? More interviews? Okay. Mm. That's good, right? But let's try it. To use auxiliaries, do or does. Okay? Do or does. Mm -hmm. Somebody else? Paulina. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and how old is she, your daughter? She's only 10, 10 years old. Oh, my. Está pequeña, ¿cómo, cómo se diría? <laughs> you can say she's still a kid. She's a kid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. she, she's a kid, yeah. She's a little girl. Yes. Mm -hmm. You can say little girl. She's a little girl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Teacher, in, yes. and if I want to the um, do, do or does, you say, do or does. if I ask her, do you do you try? No, ¿cómo podría decir? ¿Alguna vez has probado pintarlo de rosa? Mm, in this case, the structure is uh, more advanced. In this case, we can say, have you have oh. you tried or have you ever tried to dye it blue or to get it blue or the question is have you have you tried or have you ever tried mm -hmm. thank you okay aha uh -huh. interviews questions i have a question teacher okay luis to Paulina. Okay. I remember she she said she was studying chemistry. Ah, yeah. I work. Mm -hmm. You you work? Do you work as a chemistry? Yes, yes, I do. In the lab, and I have a business about the uh, soaps. Oh, oh, interesting. Where do you study? In the USAM. At, at, I, ¿verdad? At the at. USAM. Yes. Hey, I yeah. remember when I was, when I was uh, studying, I, uh, I, no sé cómo sería teacher, llevé o, o cursé esa materia. I de, took, o sea, sobre, sobre química. I took chemistry. And took. For me, for me, it was difficult to organic chemistry. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh -huh. I hate I it. Love it. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, and three. Yes. To 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 name the alkanos, alkenos. Uh, the structure is too difficult. That is um. Uh, relax for me to make the structures, the names, the relaxing. Always, I always love it. 
No, no se dice así. ¿Cómo se dice? Relax. Siempre me ha gustado, siempre me gustó. Ok. And can I ask him something? Go ahead. Do you do you study at the university or at the school chemistry? At the university. And in what car what I career. what career Actually, I'm studying medicine. Yeah. Wow. You see? That's interesting. But it's difficult. Yeah. It's difficult to talk in English. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it is not. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's, uh, okay, Hazel. Uh, para niña Alma. <laughs> Miss Alma. Ah. Ya me quiere fregar a mí, ¿verdad? <laughs> no, niña Alma, es en buen plan. Ah, desde ahorita es en buen plan. <laughs> eh, do you understand? ¿Está entendiendo? Eh, se me dificulta un poco a mí, pero trato la manera ahí de... Es que ella es del módulo desde ahí, desde el primero, por eso le pregunto. Sí, yo este, he aprendido un poco, pero no, yo las oigo y traduzco. por las cosas pero me cuesta entender lo que me lo que el teacher está hablando pero algo entiendo ya lo little by little yeah. okay. um, what is your favorite color my color my my color favorite is el no sé cómo se dice turquesa. Um, Turkish. Turkish. Y me gusta el pink también. Pink. El rosado. Gracias, niña Alma. Thank you. Thank you a usted que se acuerda de mí. <laughs> cool. Okay. So what else? More questions? Third quarter. Somebody else? Third quarter. No more questions. Turquesa. Teacher. Uh, yes. I have a question now. Okay. Yeah. Oh, can see uh Luis Menhever. <laughs> yes. Oh, Aha. Uh -huh. What, what's the question? The question is for Luis. Yes, pero está caminando, no sé qué hace, creo que no. Yo lo veo. Esa era la ¿Cómo que va a caballo? Hazel. Yes. Eh, question to. To me, please. Perdón. Question. To me, please. Ah, ask her. She wants a question. Ajá, ¿quién me pre... ¿Quién era la que me quería que le preguntara? Eva. Eva. Eva Alicia. Eva Alicia. Oh, okay. 
¿Quieres que la interrumpa? Sorry. Um, how old are you? Oh. Yes. How old? Yes, how old are you? What? How old? Uh, how old? I'm... Edad, verdad? Yes. Oh. I forty. I have forty. I am. I am forty. Ah, I am forty. Oh, yeah, I am forty. Mm -hmm. And what's what is your favorite color, Eva? My favorite color is red. Yeah. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Eh, Eva is in English, verdad? Eva. Eva. Eve. Eva. Uh, Eva. Eve. Okay. Eve. Mm -hmm. Aha, people, more questions? This is the time for you to practice. Or if you want to ask me, I remember that the first class you asked me, do you remember the interview? You asked me a lot of questions. Does is Luis Benjibar riding a bike? Yes, I guess. <laughs> I get to. Ay, Luis Benjibar, ya lo agarraron. I remember he. I remember he said he he's a soldier. Ah, yes. He's a soldier. He's a militant. Yes. Do you see the the uniform? Yes. Okay, guys. No more questions. Okay, let me take the attendance. Okay, uh, well, after this, just listen. Um, yeah. Alma Patricia? Presente, teacher. Ana Guadalupe? <laughs> Ana Lisette? Camila Lizeth. I'm here. Cristian Adalberto. Present teacher. Doris Emilia. Present teacher. Estela Marisol. I'm here. Eva Alicia. Present teacher. Griselda de la Paz. Present teacher. Herbert, Gerardo. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Hazel, Nayeli. Present teacher. Jennifer Elizabeth. Present coach. Jose David. Present teacher. Jose Luis. Present. Joshua. Here, teacher. Carla Patricia. Here, teacher. Katia Veronica. Present, teacher. Liliana Laura. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night. Luis Alberto. Present, teacher. Luis Antonio. Present, teacher. Nidia Yamilex. I'm here, teacher. Nuria Mayeli. Present. Oswaldo Stanley. Present. Paulina Viñas. 
Present, Mr. Rosa Irma. Present, teacher. Sandra Elizabeth. Present. Sarina Susana. Present. Sonia Dolores. I'm here, teacher. Okay. And Tatiana Maria. Present, teacher. All right. Thank you, guys. Um, let's do something. I, I hope you can do it. Let's try it. Oh, but so it's going to be for Monday. We don't have class tomorrow, right? Try in a notebook, try to write five questions. Okay, five questions. But with do or does, okay? Don't use the verb to be. Que no sean con el verbo to be the what is your favorite or the, where are you from? No, no, no. With the verb, the auxiliary, do or does. Uh, five, only five questions. Or if you can write more, perfect. But five is um, cool. And on Monday, you are going to interview some of your classmates using the five questions like, what do you do? Where do you work? What time do you go to work? Um, where do you spend your vacations? Uh, how often do you practice sports? You see? Five simple questions. Okay? Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Cool. Any comment or question about the class, subject, pronouns, or something? Sorry, teacher. Um, como que no comprendí mucho lo de esto último. The object pronoun. Oh, the homework. Sí. I need five sí. questions for Monday. Write five questions in a piece of paper, in your notebook or something. Okay. Um, let me see. Si no, me estoy bien clara. ¿Le pudiera preguntar en el grupo más tarde, teacher, o mañana? Mm -hmm. Five questions. Use do or does. Not to be. Only five questions with auxiliaries or five questions in simple present, right? Because this is simple present. Where do you, and can be WH questions or just no questions. Only five questions. Where do you work? What time do you get up? Uh, how often do you practice sports? Okay, just that. No, el lunes van a ser eh, lo que hicimos hoy, pero que sea más fluido. Eh, digamos, usted menciona a alguien y a esa persona le va a hacer las cinco preguntas. Ok, muchas gracias. Just like this. Yes. Gracias. Ok, thank you very much, guys. Enjoy your dinner and have a good night. Oh, enjoy the weekend. I will see you on Monday, okay? Bye. Okay, Thank you, teacher. See you Monday. Thank you. Good, good night. night. Everybody. See you on Monday. Thank you very much. Good night, everyone. Happy good weekend. Night. Thank you very much. Praise.